How do you change problems to promise? Well, the way that's always worked for me is not Chris's ideas, but God's ideas and God's leadership. How very near God is to you right now. Whether you realize it or not, God is with you. God is where you are right now. And when you realize, and I mean not just with the verbiage, I know we hear all the time, God loves us. When you really feel that in your heart, that's the difference. It's a million miles between mind and heart. And when you feel it at depth, when you know it at depth, you know that God's very nature is within us. And what does that give you? It gives you a new sense of courage that is felt deep within your mind and your heart. And you have the ability during times of greatest need to know that God's presence is where you are and that you're not alone and that God's presence is totally, completely realized. Few people have that experience, even those that go to church every week. I ask you to have that experience. I want you to know this because when you know this, you know that you know, and it changes everything. When life suddenly takes an unexpected turn, and it does often, it is natural for the human in us to seek comfort. In moments of a deep inner need, we look to something greater than our human resources to depend upon. Well, when we turn to God at such a time, sometimes just with the words, three words, God help me, it changes everything. God help me. And God in turn responds with God's great love. God never fails you, and you feel a sense of closeness with God's presence, and at such a time, new courage, unbelievable. I may, I mean, cellular courage is given to you, and you feel uplifted by God's everlasting arms. You realize that this is true for you on a continuing basis. It says in Isaiah 66, 13, As one whom his mother comforts, so I will comfort you. It's good to know that you are never outside the presence of God, never out Side the circle of God's love and care. If in any way you feel alone today or lonely today, remember that God is with you and you're never alone. You need only to turn within in prayer and feel God's loving presence that is with you right now. God is always with you to guide you, to bless you, and to help you in any of the specific needed ways that you need help. I've had it a thousand times in my lifetime, and every time it's been a blessing. No matter what you may be experiencing, God is with you and can help you God will give you peace of mind during the things that you are dealing with. And God will eventually give you the success that you seek. You relax and you know that you're not alone. You are one with God 
and one with a majority. See, when you and God combine together, you're a majority over any difficulty, any problem. You are never without the inner resources for strength and courage that you need. You're never powerless because God is all power. God is the majority of power. God is the majority of answers. God is the majority of everything you seek in your life. Right now, this minute, you are in the presence of God and God is saying to you, fear not, I will help you. In Isaiah 41, verse 13, it says this, For I, the Lord, your God, hold you in my right hand. It is I who say to you, Fear not, I will help you.